Hello and welcome back. Yeah, today it's it's about zero degrees Celsius, maybe two above at ground level. It's much colder up above. We've got the Femi X8 Mini version two. Now you know I've done at least 150 or more flights with the version one before we had that motor failure, okay? And my only issue with the version one was other than it had limited range and uh, the flight time was not that great. It had a temperature issue that anything below 10 degrees Celsius and I would get jello. I, and tons of people complained about that on the version one. Does the version two suffer from the same thing? Well, we had to wait until we had temperatures down this low. So it's now it's zero and it's about oh, 1030 in the morning or so, you know, and it's creeping up. The high today is going to be three. So up above 40, 50 meters, you're going to get up around zero minus two. Okay. So we're going to send it out. We're going to have a look, look for jello. That's what we're going to do. And also for flight time, because it is cold. Now, remember, if you go back on my video and I'll put the video up here, I think it is, I'll put it up. Uh, when we did the time test on a warm day with the pro battery now I'm using the pro battery again and that was 21 minutes okay when it went down to about 14 percent okay so this is a basically fully charged battery how long do we get okay and uh, I'm not going to answer at the end it's just going to be we're going to run the video and you be the judge and all that kind of stuff uh, maybe I will maybe I'll come in and have a little chat at the end but have a look at the video uh, if you've got a big screen to put it on, put it on a big screen. Uh, I'll run the screencaster in the, in the bottom corner and see where we're at and where we lose connection and uh, have a look and see what you think. Okay, so we're testing two things, okay? We're testing the pro battery, which means pro battery, which means it's a sub 250 drone. And secondly, uh, f for its time, okay, does the cold really affect it? And secondly, is there jello in the cold? Okay. If there isn't, it's a market improvement <clears throat> because almost every Femi I've had has had jello in the cold. Okay. So I'm cold, the dogs are cold and uh, let's get up and we'll see you at the end. Okay. Yeah, let's go. Okay. Hopefully you can hear me properly. I'm using the mic that's on my uh, current tech class uh, tablet. And, uh, the reason for today's flight, it's the Femi X8 Mini version 2. I've had, or I had, way over 100 flights with, maybe 150 flights with the version 1. And the only reason I didn't have more was because of the temperature. So I'll throw up what the UAV forecast is right now, like five minutes ago. It's about 2 degrees Celsius, and up there it's about zero. About 20, 30 meters up, it'll be about zero. So with the version one, anything under 10 degrees Celsius, I would get jello after about a minute of flying. So we're going to go up, go over the lake. Look at the difference. There's no leaves left. It's only a week later. So let's get it up in the air. Okay, and we've got 2.7K. There it goes. Here we go up. And it, it takes off really fast. It goes up to that three meter mark. Yeah. It just goes boom. So let's turn around here. Here we are, okay, and we have it now set on auto, fully auto, okay, so we're going to go up and have a look, and it's a little bit breezy, but not too bad, we're going to go out on auto, see what happens, okay, there's no updates, no nothing, and then we're going to maybe try that 200 ISO, let's get up there, it's fast, it's a fast drone, so let's get up to 2445. That'd be nice. There we go. Bring that camera down. That's beautiful. Look at that. Yeah. Let's uh, get that camera going. There we go. Let's go out. Okay. There we go. Doing good. A little bit to the left there. All the trees are barren. Okay. I can still see it there. 
we have 93 percent in the battery i'm using the pro battery so it's a sub 250 drone and uh, yeah another little lake should be popping up just about there on the right there it is We're just above the tree lines okay there we are and there we go we're just gonna turn around there oh we lost it there my goodness it just has no distance whatsoever okay come on back and it's coming home i think yeah see it's got no distance at all especially in the winter time yeah, but what i'm interested in more is the uh Come on home, buddy. There we go. Yeah, it keeps loosening stuff. That should be maybe a move over a little bit here. Get a connection better. Return to home. It's only coming home at two, 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 six meters per second. There we go. So what I'm more interested in is Get it back around the home point. There it is. We actually knew over quite a bit. You can see that. Okay. It's been up there for a minute or so. So we're going to cancel that return to home. Soon. It comes down. Cancel that. Turn it around. Let's head out this way a bit. Okay, the gale force is gone. Yeah, we're heading with the wind now. We just want to check. I don't know how old we're going. Two and a half minutes, three minutes on the video. Yeah, we gotta wait to about the five minute mark. So we're just gonna have a little jaunt around here for a couple minutes. See what happens to the video. I've got to see if there's any jello in this video. Now we're, my hands are getting cold already, so we're around the freezing mark. We're around the zero mark. Okay. And so let's go the other way. We'll just turn all the way around and come back. Turn around. That's the old, the old gravel pit, the new gravel pit, whatever it is. Yeah, the gravel pit that was supposed to it's called Cedar Vale was supposed to be closed down next year, but Happenstance B, it'll probably be there for another 10 years. Okay, so where's our home point? There we are. I love that. I love the dancing age. I love that it's there. And we're going to check. We've got about three and a half, almost four minutes. So let's just take a boo over here. There's our house. And uh, yeah, all the leaves are gone. Look at that, eh? Um, we got snow last night. This is our first snow. Not really a snowfall, just a dusting. But it looked really good. And let's come down to about, oh, I don't know, about there. Okay, we'll slow down a bit. Go rip them. Yeah. yeah, it's a little windy up there, but it does pretty good in the wind, no matter what. Over here, nothing up high as we are. Oh, there's a tree, it's got leaves on it. My goodness, the only one in the whole forest. Okay, and you see a campground behind us there. If the trailer's still there, they'll be there all winter. Nobody comes up to them, really. And then we just turn around and come back. We've got four minutes, five minutes. Okay, so we'll go out to this little lake again. And we'll go up a little bit. What's it look like? No gel force winds yet. So we're 75 now. Okay. Come down. Come down. Come down. Come down. And we turn and come back home. Turn around. Here's our H. There's our H, there it is. 
Yeah, we'll come home. We'll see what that's like. Remember, we're testing cold. So it's been up there for five, six minutes at least. And we've got 255. Okay, bring that uh, camera down. Down to the bottom. Go over the house. Let's do one orbit just for the heck of it. Oops. Okay, let's do an orbit here. Orbit. Oops, stop that video. Stop that video. We'll do an orbit. Okay. Set center. Done. Radius it out. Three, four, five. Let's radius it about one six fifty. Sure. up set counterclockwise center sure we want to go up to about seven or eight there we go go let's start that video get this up here there we go so we're going counterclockwise no we're going clockwise at about 50 meters or so out The center not quite right. No, it's not doing too well. It looks like a fifty meter circle to me. Yeah, let's do the wind. There we go. Okay, let's bring this down. Low battery. Oh, turn out. Okay, let's stop that. Okay. And return to home. And it returns to home. Battery went down pretty quick, didn't it? And it's coming down. We're down to 23%. Cold weather affects it. So, this is only, I dare say, 50 minute flight. Look at that. 10 minutes. It's going down. Here we go. So, we're going to. have to wait and see where it lands. It's slowing down. I would say it's bang on. Uh, it's within a couple of feet. Stop. And it's automatically stops the video. That's great. Okay, let's go ahead and have a look at this video. Okay, we're at the end there. How was that? Okay. I didn't really notice any jello. Really. And I thought that being on auto, it was pretty good. Okay. The EV value was pretty good. The ISO was pretty good. And that's because it's not completely blue sky. There's some blue, but it's not a constantly bright blue sky day so it's that mid-range between overcast and say cloudy which seems to do pretty good some of the colors aren't exact it's a little oversaturated just a touch in some areas but a lot better okay it's a lot better than the version one and i saw the i thought the dynamic range was a little bit better as well okay so the Femi X8 Mini version 2 has 
limited range, I'll give it that. It doesn't have that great a range because it's only got one antenna in the front, okay? Uh, it's also got very limited flight time when it's cold. Notice that reduction in the flight time. We may have got 10 minutes if we were lucky, okay? From the 21 when it was warm, okay? So be leery of that. I was a little suspicious. I didn't, know, I didn't really pay that much attention because we started with a pretty full battery. But then when I got the battery warning, oh, okay, well, we got to bring it in. Okay, anyway, that was that. Okay, so we ended up uh, about 20% or something like that, 21%, I can't remember. So that's that. Uh, lastly, the jello issue. Okay, I didn't really see the jello issue. I thought it was pretty good throughout the whole flight, and that was about a seven minute flight or so, six or seven minute flight. Um, so it was out in the cold for about 10 minutes altogether. So that it was pretty good. It was pretty good. So the Femi X8 Mini version two has a lot of pros, but has a lot of glitches. Okay, and I just wish Femi would get onto this, but apparently, and I've been after them ever since the day that I got it to do something about it, there's been nothing. There's been a camera update, which didn't do any good and they haven't addressed any of the other issues. Okay, and I'll list them in the description below. Okay, as always, read the description because there's more things there than what's in the filming when I do the video. And again, you know, hit the subscribe, hit the like, hit the bell, all that kind of stuff. And if you feel so inclined, buy me a coffee. Okay, we'll see you next time. And we've got a few good things coming. Um, I've been on AliExpress and uh, we're gonna try and get a couple of things coming in. So uh, yeah, get out there, get some fresh air, and believe me, it is fresh. Okay, see you later.